Hello everyone, good evening. I hope you are fine and you're having a good day. We are Tuesday, yes, Tuesday the 11th of September. A heavy day in the memories, yet a day we could have spent in light and in love. Um, tonight I'm going to channel uh, Master Saint-Germain. Um, if you don't know him, you can have a look after the video, of course. Um, or you can just jump into the unknown and feel what you have to feel. So you can ask a um, question in the comments. And um, I already have, I think, a message of the week. Let's see. For this week, this upcoming week, let's see what is the message. So it seems that the transmission channeling tonight is going to be with a lot of um, small words, very, I feel very direct and straight and cold, not uh, constructive sentences. Um, hello, Nick, how are you? <laughs> Thank you. So let's see what is the message for this week. So it's from Maître Saint-Germain, Master Saint-Germain, Saint-Germain in English. So it's words, it's transition, alchemy, clarification, purification, love. So you can close your eyes with me if you feel so and feel the energies and I will answer to the question after the, um, the transmission. Welcome everyone. Okay. Clarification. I am a master of light. Alchemist. I know how to transcend and transmute things from silver to gold, from rock to gold, from fear to love. My dear ones, we keep repeating to you and I repeat it tonight. Let go, just let go and transform. Transform your life. Transform everything that doesn't serve you anymore into gold, into love. You have to love your life. You have to love every part of your life. Healing energy is sent now. Clarification. You need to clarify your thoughts. In my times, when I was incarnated on earth, People were more, more simple. I can feel in your minds a lot of activity. Very busy, busy. In my ages, people had a very simple way of thinking. It doesn't mean they were stupid. Far from that. You can call upon me, Saint-Germain, when you need clarification and when you need to find solutions regarding a problem. I incarnate, incarnate different energies. My new version in this world, my new energy, is like a ray of light laser. It has this power, but my old energy coming from when I was incarnated on earth is more round. Let me explain you. When you have a thought, 
you can either turn it round and build around it, creating a ball of thoughts, like when you knit, or you can use the energy of looking through what is to see what is true. Both solutions are available, yet in these times, I preconize the use of a laser. I'm sorry to make it more simple and visual to you, but it is the only way you can understand. You have to do abstraction, get rid of everything that is not serving your truth. It starts with me, with my energy, with your thoughts, your mind. If you feel that your idea is complicated and turning, like creating a big ball, drop it. This is not good. Start again. Ask to see the truth. What is the core idea? Go deep in the core idea. What are you building around? What are you building around? Transmutation. If you wish to see clear in your thoughts, energies right now, I'm going to send you a transmutation energy. Breathe in deeply and feel. Clarification, healing. You would ask, where does he want to bring us? What's the point? The point is that all creation comes from thought. And your thoughts are a mess right now, all of you, including the channel. You can still create from that, but you waste a lot of energy and time. This is my transmission today to you, my dear ones. Accept not to know, accept to let go, and accept to trust the laser thoughts, the one that are very simple. These times are confusing, very confusing. If you know it or no, I can assure you that these times are confusing. Arrogance. Don't be arrogant. Arrogance is a way of putting weight in your thoughts and your mind system. Simplicity. That's why I talk about clarification, transcendence. Clarify your thoughts. Lose yourself in the good way. The energies are really intense. You need to be pure to be able to go through these energies. 
For that, I repeat my message tonight for you all is to clarify your thoughts. For that, breathe and go back to the root, the main thought. Like when you're writing a document, you want to expose an idea. You have to think about the core idea of your work, isn't it? I ask you to do the same in everyday life, in all your little and big actions. What is the core of this thought system regarding my love life, my work, my friendships, my finance, my health. What is the core idea behind all these satellite thoughts around it? With thoughts in a ball, you will turn around like a ball and you won't have stability with the gravity. Only a sharp and clear, unique thought will make you able to create in light and to be happy and at peace. That is the human experience right now, this week. Even if there's no week, and one day you will understand what I'm telling you. But let's stay in this configuration of your thought system social one, society one, with time, frame, calendar, 24 hours. Do you feel those 24 hours? But I won't go there now because the channel is telling me that I have to answer your questions. I'd be glad and I am at your service. Okay, so, <laughs> Saint-Germain, <laughs> uh, do you have any question live? And if not, I received one from Nick, who is online. So I wait first, we have a few minutes left. Don't worry, Nick, I will answer. Uh, not me, but you will have the answer. We have a few minutes left with, uh, I play with my, <laughs> with my stones. Um, well, it tells me I have to be clear either also right now so okay so i'm going to answer to nick and if you have questions meanwhile you can ask them so how soon am i going i'm going to be hearing guidance from spirits so nick sent me this email earlier how soon i am am i going to be hearing guidance from spirits as soon as you wish you still have a thought system. It's all about thoughts tonight. That believes that you need something special to be able to hear spirits. First of all, define spirits. Your question is, this is a big mosquito. <laughs> How soon I'm gonna be hearing guidance from spirits? Your question is not clear. It describes a system of thoughts that is not clear either. First define what is spirit? What is your core thoughts in this snake? and answer what is your core question thank you and the second question is hello caroline if you have any question you can ask oh there's a mosquito the second question is from nick and nick please interact because it's like <laughs> how soon will i do my own business so i can give my mum a rest as she's working from past 28 years. I repeat, how soon will I do my own business so I can give my mom a rest as she's working 
She's been working for the past 20 years. How soon will I do my own business? And I asked Saint-Germain not to talk about thoughts, <laughs> if I may. <laughs> because it's, it gave me the answer as soon as your thoughts are clear, but I'm going to inquire a little more. Okay. There's no time. There's no soon or late. Drop. Listen to your heart. Follow your heart. I see six or a year, six months or a year. But to make it happen, you have to put down very clear thoughts about your business. What is your core thought? What is your aim? What do you want to do? Wanting to make your mom work, stop working, is not a good intention for the universe as you're not responsible for your mother. It's your mother karma to live this. Sorry to be that strict, but this is the truth. You can love your mother and I deeply understand your concern and I respect it. Yet, on paper, for your business, you have to have a core intention that is for your own purpose, your own mission. Please inquire about your mission. Drop any guilt. Follow your intuition, be happy, be clear. I ask you to be clear. So yes, it's gonna start soon, but it depends on you doing this work of clarification of your intentions. God knows that you want to help your mother, of course, but this is not a good enough into brackets intention for your own sole purpose. I hope you understand this and you're not offended because behind all these words is just huge love and healing. Dear Nick, you need to heal your guilt regarding your mother. Bless you. Okay, uh, Nick, are you here? Are there other questions? Let's see, we have a few minutes. Oh no, I already went after. Um, okay, Nick, you please interact. And uh, if you don't have the answer now, we can do it by email after. I will continue to channel for you. Okay, Caroline, is it right for me now to receive initiation to the violet flame? <laughs> it's always. It says, you wouldn't be here tonight if it wasn't right for you. As you know that I'm, I'm the master of a violet flame. I created it. I incarnated it, putting the seed on earth so it can be used by humans after my departure from the human body. Let's read the question. Is it right for me to receive the initiation to the violet flame? If you ask the question, the answer is in the question. As I already said, you were already, you are here tonight. There's nothing wrong into receiving this sensation and it is not a power, but find the good teacher 
to receive the initiation. I feel hesitation. Maybe you have a choice. My only advice would be whatever I, the same I said since the beginning of this conversation with all of you is clarify your thoughts. What is your intention wanting to do this initiation? Find the core thought behind it. Then you will see clearly and you will know what is good for you. With whom? Because yes, it is good. You need it now for sure. And I bless you for being part of this amazing family of people bathing and using the violet flame, purifying the aura, purifying life, connecting to me and all the angels of the violet flame. Amen. Hello, Tina, how are you? <laughs> Caroline, I hope it's a good answer. I'm not good, but I hope you had the answer. Okay, Nick, you have the answer too. Um, okay, are there more questions? If not, I'm gonna, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna go in French. I don't know, as I said last week, now if it's, it's not gonna be the same thing. It's gonna be Saint-Germain in French, perhaps for French people, or even you, if you continue, there's gonna be other messages. Let's see if there's a, a word for, um, to end it. Let's see what he has to say. He <laughs> keeps repeating. Clear your thoughts, please, my dear. Do it this week. Use paper, pencil, pen, and clear your thoughts. What are my intentions? What is the main thought behind all this? Is it guilt? Do I feel guilt, love, fear? It's an emotion, but it's a thought. Like Nick, I want to save my mom. It's a thought. What is behind this? Guilt, thought, emotion, guilt. Stay in silence. Ask for guidance. Ask for Saint Germain, me, and for the violet flame. And visualize something violet going into your head and on your paper. Ask for clarification of thoughts. I'm going to do a last transmission now of energies, clearing, and making your path so easily, my dear ones. You see how clear it is? Be simple. Thank you. Okay. I'm going to continue in French. Thank you, everyone. See you. Bye. <laughs>